If you're looking for reliable money drop services for GTA Online, look no further than Digizani, where they offer many, many services. Just be sure to use code JACO for 5% off at checkout. A few days ago now, I am a little bit late, but we got this really eerie message from Rockstar Games, and it's kind of exciting, kind of worrying, kind of, I don't know, it's, it's making me a little anxious as well as a bunch of other people in the community. And it's this right here, it's Rockstar on their website thanking us for GTA 5 and GTA Online and all the support over the years, and they even give credit to everyone involved in making the game and making all the online updates and etc which is really really surprising to see honestly especially nine years later just kind of out of the blue now this is probably no means the end of gta online there's per probably still going to be a couple more years of updates in my opinion we'll probably get update to finish off the year and then probably one or two updates next year in 2023 and i think they're going to continue updating it until we get at least an announcement for gta 6 or a trailer or in a release date or even like uh you know anything about gta 6 hopefully soon um, I think they're going to continue updating it until then, maybe not until launch, but maybe up until like 6 to 12 months until GTA 6 is launch. Now I'm no insider, but there has been talk of a new PlayStation conference or PlayStation showcase that is going to take place later this month of September. It was supposed to be last month, but got canceled for some reason. Now the only reason I know this is because I'm excited for the new Spider-Man game, so it is maybe likely that Rockstar themselves reveals or shows off a trailer or something on GTA 6 during this PlayStation conference. Maybe. I don't know. Of course. I, I don't work for them, so it's a possibility though. It's been a rough past couple of years for Rockstar and some of their updates, like this summer's update wasn't as great, Red Dead Online losing, you know, updates and support and that kind of th thing, and of course the trilogy, that was a complete and utter mess, and then um, cease and desisting modders and other, there's just been a whole lot of drama and stuff around Rockstar and Take-Two Interactive these past couple of years, so... Maybe they're finally just thanking us for all the support and sticking with them, or maybe they're just doing it out of the kindness of their hearts, but I personally think that it's going to probably lead up to GTA 6 and its update or release or trailer or teaser or something like that. I don't know. It's crazy to think after nine years, Rockstar is finally acknowledging, maybe, possibly coming to the end and thanking us for it, but... I still think we got another year, year and a half left, so I don't think it's going anywhere anytime soon, but to finally know that there's a light at the end of the tunnel, maybe with a six in it, it's kind of awesome. It's kind of kind of crazy to think about that after nine years, we're finally getting towards something, and Rockstar themselves says that they're even working on this, that they're in um, underway of development for years now, so it's 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 a, quite the possibility, and I think that it's what it is for, is GTA 6, but let me know what you guys think down below in the comments. Please remember to drop a like and subscribe, turn on post notifications. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.